certain area. Come on out. All right, all right. Beauty. Hello, Big B. I wasn't expecting anyone. I know this looks a little odd. Why'd you hide when I walked up? Well, I didn't know who it was. You can't be too careful these days. No, you can't. Damn it, I'm late. Please, Bigby. Promise me you won't tell Beast you saw me. He worries too much as it is, and it would just make my life a lot easier. Sure. You promise? I promise. Thank you, Big B. I'll explain it all to you later. I will, but I have to go. Thank you for trusting me. Really, I... I appreciate it, Big B. since I got any mail. Seventh day in a row. Damn thing fell off again. How much longer is this going to go on? Bigby, hey, wait up. Have you seen my wife? Have you seen Beauty? Nope, haven't seen her. Oh, okay. Sorry to bother you. Damn it. Something's going on.
Big B. I'm in your chair, huh? I've only got the one. So yeah. Got a smoke? Thanks. A couple thousand more of these will be even on that house you owe me. This has got to stop. You can't keep sneaking off the farm like this. The fresh air and sunshine pitch they sell you on is bullshit. I didn't escape out of the homelands to end up in some prison, okay? Don't send me back there, Big B. You don't know what it's like, okay? You haven't been there. Don't be a pain in the ass. I'll tell you what I told Toad. And what's that? You're putting all of Fabletown at risk. Lectured by the Big Bad Wolf. He must have loved that. That for me? Nope. The house didn't blow itself down, Big B. That's all I'm saying. Do with that what you will. Now, I'm not saying it's reason enough for me to have definitely been offered a drink, but, uh... It would have helped ease some of the pain you once caused me, yes. It also would have shown everyone how different you are now. Nice. I take it all back. This is why everyone hates you. It wasn't murder. I was hungry. Yeah, well I'm hungry now. You don't see me tearing the flesh off of your bones. But you would, if you could. Probably. But, uh, no. Um, hate's the wrong word. They fear you more than anything. You ate a lot of people back in your day. I thought we were all supposed to have a fresh start here. I can't change the past. Well, you can't change people's memories, either. Look, I'm not saying it's fair, but it's real. People are scared of you. I mean, look at your hands. Who'd you get in a fight with? A fable, right? I'm sure you're not going around punching Mondays. I was doing my job, believe it or not. Your job is to beat the shit out of fables? 
Sometimes I take him to the farm. Fuck you. You think my job is easy? You try keeping a bunch of fables from killing each other. How do you think this all works? I don't know. How? By being big and being bad. By being big and being bad. Don't say that shit in front of people. It's embarrassing. That's the attitude that gets you in trouble. I'm sure you were shitty to everyone you came across tonight. Mm, not everyone. Name one. Uh, I don't actually know her name. Awesome. Great example. Life is easier with friends, Bigby. And we live a long fucking time. I know you like this whole lone wolf thing you got going for yourself. But I've seen the way you look at snow, okay? You're not fooling me. Will you shut up? Well, maybe if my throat wasn't so parched, I wouldn't have to keep talking. Wait, that doesn't Just make sense. Just give me a drink, please. Colin, enough already. I haven't slept in two days. I went out a second story window and... I want to get in two seconds of shut-eye before I... Look, if I give you this, will you let me sleep? Yeah, yeah, all right. Probably. Thanks, Bigby.